Hey there everybody, welcome back! This is Sarah, today I'll be showing you another Yummy Nummies kit. This is the birthday cake maker and was given to me by Blip Toys. This set is a party pack, which means that you can make it with a bunch of your friends. The box says that it makes six mini cakes. And the cakes are three layered with frosting and delicious sprinkles. So here's everything that comes inside of the box. You get six plastic trays, one packet of vanilla cake mix, one packet of chocolate frosting mix, one packet of purple frosting mix, a packet of sprinkles, six paper cake stands, several knives, several spoons, three plastic scoops, and of course some easy to follow instructions. You will also need some water, a pair of scissors, and a microwave. And for all you guys out there who are wondering if I cleaned my microwave, yes I did. <laughs> Alright, well let's get started. First I'm going to cut my plastic tray on the indented line. Then I'm going to grab my cake batter mix and pour in 10 scoops of the batter into tray number one. I will also add four scoops of water. Give everything a really good mixy mixy until you have a delicious looking cake batter. Scoop out the cake batter into each of the three sections until you reach the fill line. Now this goes into your microwave for anywhere between 15 to 20 seconds. Alright, I put my cakes in for 20 seconds and now, just after they're about to cool, I'm going to push them down so that they're flat on top. Now it's time to make some delicious frosting. I'm going to make the chocolate one first. Put in 5 scoops of the chocolate frosting mix into tray number 2. Add one scoop of water and give this one a really good mixy mixy until you have this yummy delicious thick chocolate frosting. Mmm. Mine came out a little thick but you can always thin it down by adding a little water. I'm also going to make the purple frosting because I definitely have to try both flavors of frosting. This is the same recipe as the previous chocolate one. You're going to add five scoops of the purple frosting mix with one scoop of water. Ooh, this frosting looks just like the one I made in the Yummy Nummies Donuts video. Now it's time to assemble our cakes, so I'll just take them out of the mold Add some delicious chocolatey fudgy frosting. Repeat the same thing for the other two layers. I'm gonna attempt to put my cake on this paper cake stand that came in the set. cake! I decided to put the little cake top stand on my plate and I also added some sprinkles to the top of my cake. Here's how the purple frosted one turned out, a little bit better looking than my chocolate one. With all the cake batter mix that was included in the set, I was only able to make five complete cakes. I may have been a little bit too generous with adding a bit too much batter to each of my cakes. 
Now it's time for my most favorite part, the taste test. Wow, the cake is so spongy. Maybe instead of a spoon, I'll just pick it up with my hands. <gasps> mm! Oh my gosh, this is so delicious. This tastes like real cake. I have to polish this off, it's so good. Mmm. This tastes just like having your own mini cake. It tastes just like the real thing, even the chocolate frosting. Now let's try the purple frosting one. Mmm. This one's really good too. I know some of you guys weren't crazy about the purple frosting on the donut, but it goes really well with this vanilla cake. I might as well polish this one off too. Mmm, so delicious. Well guys, I was completely 100% happy with this birthday cake maker. The cakes were absolutely delicious. My personal favorite was the chocolate one, but the purple one was really good too. Before this set, my favorite one was the cupcake one, but now this is a new favorite. This is my number one. Well, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And as always, we'll be seeing you in the next video.